Are you troubled by strange noises in the middle of the night? Do you experience feelings of dread in your basement or attic? Have you or any of your family ever seen a spook, specter, or ghost? If the answer is yes, then don't wait another minute. Pick up your phone and call the professionals. Go Ghostbusters! The 1984 original Ghostbusters is simply a masterpiece of cinema, with characters played by actors that have significant charisma. This film does so much in a short period of time, it's incredible. During the beginning of the film, we see three scientists decide to go into an extermination business making money off of it. During the first time they catch a ghost, it was their first time operating the equipment. When Slammer finally runs into a ballroom, they manage to trap the ghost, but not without damaging the room. So to help them cover the costs, Egon decides to have Vankman charge the hotel manager $5,000 in order to pay for any expenses. Then the movie shows a montage of newspapers and news reports about the Ghostbusters. When it ends, we then begin to get the introduction of Winston. On top of that, we also get to see Walter Peck, one of the side antagonists of the movie. When Vankman refuses to show Walter where the containment grid is, it sets up for future problems to unfold like Dana and Lewis uniting to show the main antagonist, and also the releasing of ghosts from the containment grid. All of this accumulates in the third act of the Ghostbusters getting escorted to the hotel, allowing the characters to come full circle as part of the story circle, where in the first act they were just beginning to learn how to use the equipment. When they reach the top of the apartment building, the main antagonist, Gozer, reveals itself. The Ghostbusters try to use their proton packs against Gozer, but it seems not to work. Then, Gozer disappears and asks what destructor should take place. Stay Puffed appears, destroying everything in its path. When they fire the proton streams at Stay Puffed, it seems to affect him, but not enough to severely damage him. Stay Puff then climbs up the building, and the Ghostbusters accumulate into a small vent of some kind. Egon tells them that they can cross the streams to close the gate. They decide to do it, and they end up blowing up the top of the building, destroying the gate. 